had sunglasses on my face, so I hope you can't see like the marks on my nose. They like, give me the worst marks on my nose from wearing them because they're that style. But I wanted to go ahead and start off the vlog, welcome you back to another video. I hope my hair isn't crazy because I just drove with the windows down because it's really nice outside here in Florida, Orlando to be exact. Um, but I just got my hair done yesterday, I had all intention of vlogging or at least talking to the camera yesterday but i had a really long day i woke up at 4 50 to go work out which i usually don't do i usually only do that on thursdays but i was getting my hair done after work and i've been really trying to stick with the five day a week workouts um so i was trying to like hit that goal and i knew i was gonna be taking a couple days off next week so i had a really long work day it's friday usually busy but my boss was out on spring break all last week so that was nice it was a little bit slower in that aspect like more work wasn't being necessarily added to my to-do list but and then I sat in the salon chair for almost four hours to get my hair done yeah but I wanted to go ahead and start the vlog we'll come back to another video I'm gonna help my dad out for a couple of hours and then I'll pick up the camera probably after okay I've been home for a couple of hours but I quickly went to Publix because I'm working with do you remember a couple videos ago I went to Porch Fest and I was basically there to film content for a popcorn company called Jolly Time and I'm working with them again to put together a kind of recipe style TikTok or reel for them to use for their social media and things like that so I'm really excited because this recipe is so easy and it's the perfect blend of salty sweet yeah I'm excited to use their popcorn I got the blast of butter one and they sell these at Publix local grocery stores you can find them and you can also search on their website for locations near you so I'm using this and I'm doing a cookies and cream style one so I got just Oreo cookies and then the Ghirardelli white chocolate chips and then to make it a little bit more fun, I went to Party City and I got these um, little boxes. They're called favor boxes, but I'm gonna use them for putting all the popcorn in there and making them look cute. So I got these as well. I thought that'd be like a cute little ad instead of just doing it in a bowl. So I'm gonna make this. I'll obviously share if it's good and I'll link the recipe. It's, you know, just a couple ingredients, so it's not really a recipe, but I'm gonna do this and then um, there's a couple things that I need to show you. Clothes wise, I got a package in from a brand and wanted to share that. Maybe I'll share that tomorrow or later tonight. Okay, I just finished making, or I guess taking all the clips. I still have to put the video together and probably do a voiceover. But here's how the popcorn came out. Absolutely insane. You put it in the fridge for a little bit for the white chocolate to harden. Looks insane. So we're gonna snack on this. It's like a pre-dinner snack. I'll probably bag up the rest. I think it turned out so cute with the boxes. So I'm glad I went and got those and it's so so yummy okay i just changed i'm wearing this new shirt actually i'll talk more about them tomorrow i picked up a few pieces but it's from lily silk and it's made with mulberry silk which is like more of a sustainable silk and manufacturing process and i just recently discovered them and i picked up a couple cute pieces and i'm excited to share them with you so this top is from them. I just have it tucked into some jeans. And then I got these clear heels from Zara. I just got them actually. Krisha and I are going to take our engagement photos next week. And for some reason, I just didn't like a lot of the white bridally heels. I just felt like I wouldn't get a lot of wear out of them. And the dress that I'm wearing, I kind of want the attention to be on the dress and not so much on the shoes. So I just got clear heels and I figured I could get so much use out of clear heels and I could wear them for non-bridal things and bridal things. These aren't going to be my wedding shoes or anything, but I thought for the engagement photos 
and just to have would be great. So I'll link them. They were under $50 from Zara. Just a great find and they're super comfortable. Don't know how comfortable they are with continued wear, but just from wearing them for the past 15, 20 minutes walking around the apartment, they've been great. So this is the fit. I'm just gonna grab a little clutch bag and we're gonna head to dinner. We're going to Agave Azul. We haven't been in so long. Sorry, this like glare in the mirror keeps throwing me off. But we haven't been to Agave in so long. A couple summers ago, we used to go like every single weekend. It was crazy. It's the best Mexican food ever. But we're gonna head to dinner, meet up with some friends and enjoy some Mexican food. Day. just made a smoothie I just was steaming some clothes I did all my laundry yesterday so I didn't have to worry about it today but I wanted to do a collective haul of some things that I've gotten sent to me by brands so kindly who have sent me these things first I wanted to talk about Lily Silk which is the shirt that I was kind of talking about last night briefly before we left to go to dinner. That was one of the items that I picked up from them. I love what this brand stands for. They're zero waste, very environmentally conscious by using mulberry silk. So the first top is the one that you saw last night. This is like the softest material top. So breathable, very, very nice high quality. It has their little logo on the front, which I think elevates it a little bit. I think this is like the perfect top to dress up or dress down. I love the blue and white striped, very nautical, very spring, summer. You could dress this up with trousers, wear it to work. You could even throw it over as like a bathing suit cover up with some linen pants, linen shorts. Perfect item for spring and into summer. So this was the first item that you saw on me. Next is this black silk skirt. It has a slit right here on the side, which is nice. It hits about shin length on me. It's high-waisted, great fabric material. You could dress this up, dress it down. It's kind of like a work to happy hour type of skirt. You could also dress it down, wear it with sneakers. This is such a great skirt to have in your closet for spring, summer, and even into fall. Really excited to have this in my closet. Again, great, great material. And I did get two more items. One of the items, unfortunately, it didn't really work for me. They do not fit. They're just a little bit big, but it was these trouser pants, which would be so cute for the office. They're just a little bit too big on me. Great material though, and I love the color. And then I have been loving these to wear to work. Sweaters like this that button up the front. You could totally wear this to the office, opened or completely buttoned up like it is right here. You could wear it with trouser pants. You could dress it down, linen shorts, linen pants. I think it's so perfect as like a throw over your shoulder type of sweater. Really great material. And they also have this in another pattern on their site. I believe it's like a blue and white striped but I got it in this navy blue color, and then it has the nice gold hardware on it. Super, super cute. Everything is made with such great material and fabric that I'm blown away by material and just how high-end and luxe it feels. So that's everything that I got from Lily Silk. I have a coupon code, I'll put it on the screen right here. I'll also link all the pieces down below that I got with their sizes and the coupon code in the description box as well. Next is, this is such a great concept. It's almost like a sleeping bag for your tan. It's called a sleep sack, self tan sleep sack. It's 100% premium silky polyester, I believe. It has a built-in pillow protector. It's pretty large, comes with a travel bag. It has a foot opening to keep your feet cool. So, kind of wanted to open it up. But yeah, the main reason why I don't sleep in my self tanner is because I don't like it to get on my bed sheets. 
So I can link this down below if you're interested or if you're a self trainer and you want to get something like this. I feel like it's pretty affordable. Yeah, it's just like a silky, almost like a sleeping bag in a way. I think you can slide your pillow in one side so it protects. And then it's also like that nice material. I sleep with silk pillowcases. So this is kind of like the same idea to where your skin kind of glides across it. So this is really cool. I will link it down below if you're interested, or if you're an avid self-tanner, like I am. Lastly, I got this red light. Well, no, it's not only red light. It's, I think it has seven or eight different lights by Medjolin. And if you guys know, I use the light therapy face mask by them and neck and chest. And this is such a great option as well. If you're interested, I think this is cheaper than the face mask and the neck and chest mask combined and you lay under this i listen to a podcast laying underneath this take a nap i know my friend maya has this exact one and she just takes a quick little nap underneath it but i listen to a podcast it's so relaxing it comes with eye protection and you can flip through each light set the time you can even set it for up to an hour this one you can add an essence to it and it will like mist your face, which is so cool. So I can link this down below. I have a running coupon code with them. So if you're interested in picking some light therapy device up, definitely check it out and use my coupon code. I think red light therapy is so great for producing collagen preventing wrinkles and kind of just softening fine lines and just like helping with everything like that. So those are, the items that I wanted to share with you guys really quick. We'll link everything down below with coupon codes and all of the additional details. But yeah, I'm gonna sip on my smoothie. I think watch a couple of YouTube videos. I was kind of productive this morning that I didn't really have any downtime. So I'm just gonna sit down, chill. I need to edit a YouTube video later to post tomorrow. And yeah. Okay, I'm gonna change the filter on this it was notifying me to change it and i got these off of amazon and i got a two pack i usually buy them directly from william sonoma because it's kind of i've been kind of scared to purchase them from amazon but i think they're the same thing and i got two for the price of one from william sonoma so it just made more sense to buy these and it looks the exact same Maybe slightly different, so I hope it's fine. Okay, let's see how it sounds when I turn it on. Okay, it sounds normal, so we'll see. I got home from the grocery store probably like 30 minutes ago when I prepped my lunch for the week. It's a short week. Christian and I go out of town on Wednesday night to take our engagement photos in West Palm Beach. So I didn't really want to meal prep a ton. So I just did tuna salad. It's just canned tuna. I did green onion, celery, mayo, onion powder, garlic, powder, salt, things like that. And I'm gonna eat it with a cucumber, and then some crackers. Also cut up fruit. This mango, there was some ripe mango. Mango doesn't go in season until May, but there was some really good ones and it reminds me of last summer. Christian and I used to eat mango all the time. I used to get like five or six and it's so good on yogurt bowls for breakfast. It's just incredible. So we have a little bit for that. And then strawberries, I've been obsessed with strawberries. They are in season and they have been on sale. So I've been buying them and putting it on Overnight oats, really, really yummy. Could also put it on yogurt. But this is lunch meal prep for the week. Super, super easy. It takes like five seconds. So just wanted to share. Okay, I just finished filming a voiceover for the Jolly Time little video that I filmed yesterday and put together. And we're about to head to dinner. Christian's just finishing up something for work. But I wanted to show these boxer shorts because i'm gonna be living in boxer shorts 
spring and summer. They're so cute, so comfy, just super easy to throw on with anything, like a tank top, sweatshirt. I have this sweatshirt kind of tucked up. Could do a t-shirt, literally anything. They're so comfortable and you can even wear them to bed. <laughs> But these ones are from Oddly or Oddly. I can link these down below, they're so cute. I wore the red plaid ones yesterday. <laughs> now I'm wearing the navy blue plaid ones. They're so cute. I think these are gonna be such a trend again. They were a huge trend last spring and summer. So I'm excited that they're back. Or at least for me, they're back. And I'm wearing them all spring and summer. So I can link them. This is the little fit we're gonna go get. I think we're gonna get this healthy salad place for dinner. <laughs> 